Hey again, everyone, Nick here at Used Bikes Direct, checking out this 2015 V-Rod. Hop on the website, usedbikesdirect.com, to see those detailed photos and specs. Give us a call with any questions at 866-576-2453. So like I said, this is a 2015 model Harley-Davidson V-Rod. It's going to feature Harley's 1247cc V-twin engine in it, paired up to a 5-speed transmission. This one we're checking out today is 5,905 miles on it. Definitely in great condition. Naturally, you're going to show a little bit of wear and some weathering along the way, just like what you see in the wheel and the forks, as well as some of those faint little surface scratches and some of the chrome and in some of this black paint. Of course, keep in mind, black bike is going to show things like that. Now, the main thing I'm going to want to show you is actually going to be on the right side of the handlebar on that brake lever. You can see where it is bent around and scratched up. And then things like the exhaust having a couple of touches of rust along the way. Of course, that is a Vance and Hines exhaust, so it gives it a fantastic tone, and we'll give that a listen here in just a minute. Rear wheel, more or less what we saw up front. Same with this rear fender, just a few scratches and one light chip that's going to be right there. Now, as we sweep around to the left side of the bike, just going to point out on this coil here, we do have a spot of rust. And then the rest of the left side is going to be more or less a reflection of what we saw on the right. Definitely hasn't been abused in any way, shape, or form. You just got a little bit of wear along the way in the wheels and in some of those black plastics. Anyway, as we go to hop up top, we'll take a look at those controls. So starting off on the left-hand side, of course, you're going to have the usual headlight, turn signal, and your horn. But I do want to point out where you have some paint flake going on right here. Sweeping over to the right, you're going to have your kill switch, starter button, and your right turn signal. And then we'll go ahead and take a look at the display itself. Now, one spot I want to point out, right down here, you can see where you have that little ding. And of course, we'll flip that selector on so the display will come to life. Analog gauges, they are going to be throughout with that digital readout for the odometer 5905. Anyway, let's go ahead and fire it up. Listen how she sounds. Right, guys so be sure to find us on the web to see more at usebikesdirect.com reach out to us with those questions at 866-576-2453